हेलो एवरी वन टूडे वी हैव डॉक्टर चिराग विभाकर He is a principal at Gujarat Power Engineering and Research Institute. He having total 25 years of experience. So today's agenda of the interview is to know about thoughts of education. So welcome you on College Dunya portal, sir. Let's start with your interview. So my first question is to you, sir. When you first came to the Gujarat Power Engineering and Research Institute, what was your vision for the institute? First of all, namaskar, pranam. When I first came to know about Gujarat Power Engineering Research Institute. which is popularly known as chiperi and is a constituted college of gujarat technological university chandkhera ahmedabad and other way we can say that it means managed by gtu and we know that gtu is a premier academic and research institute established by government of gujarat and with about 4 lakh students and affiliated across 486 colleges so my vision of our institute is very simple the college will be the exemplary institute for all the affiliated college of gtu yes we are doing well or best for achieve this vision and why because we have a very good infrastructure we have a good facility laboratory wise we have a support from our staff member because staff member are so uh, experienced and young and dynamic and yes one more thing that is very important that we are the part of well known state university of gtu okay that's great sir so my second question is to you sir being the principal of gujarat power engineering and research institute what is your philosophy of leadership and how would you describe your leadership style my philosophy for leadership is simple as a leader i always try to lead and curve a smooth path for my students and staff member so that they don't have any kind of hardness any e kind of any problem to meet a person a higher person and another way i can say that my leadership style is more a communicated type instead of ordering i tend to communicate with my students instead of my ordering with something so i believe that to make a bridge between students and a staff and also the between staff and the management leader have a main role so i always try to do a such a way that i will become a bridge between all this area oh that's great thought for the leadership sir so my next question is to you sir how do you tend to establish a healthy relation and environment in your gujarat power engineering and research institute yes uh well question madam uh we make sure that there is a ample amount of interaction between faculties and the students this is our first priority second we use various kind of activity such as for the students and staff such as like we are organize tech fest we are organize a kind of uh, other festivals of culture related even pedagogy event so in this event students and staff are more interactive and they are more come close secondly we believe in this family right means parivar so we have kept a whatsapp group the name is given jiperi parivar so i believe personally i believe that the if we play together if we pray together if we take a food together it will make healthy relation and a good environment for the college oh that's great sir so my next question is to you sir what are the usp of the institute of jiperi and what are the advantage student can have after completing their studies from gujarat power engineering and research institute as jiperi yes uh, we have many usp but major usp we can say that our fees because our fees is like a government college or in grantinet college and the infrastructure that we have that is like good self finance college so i mentioned that earlier that jpr is under the umbrella of gtu so all the facility of gtu that will be directly benefit say for example iip scheme international education program facility ssip gisc placement cell uh, nominal transport facility sports facility so all the kind of facility we have and there is at very nominal rate and particularly in some of the scheme there is no any charge so this is our we can say that usp one more thing i want to tell you that we are following aict 360 feedback system so that feedback system that directly helpful to the students 
So these are the measure we can say that the USP of our institute. Okay, great, sir. So my last question is to you, sir. Any suggestion you would like to give the current youth and the aspiring students? Yes, I love students because I was a student not only for a three year or four year because I was a students for uh, nearly fifteen years. Why? Because I did diploma, B, M, E, PhD, and postdoctorate. So I always uh, feel like a students. So I just say the message for the students and the young generation that today's youth are technocrats and smart. So I would like to tell them. to do a uh, take good food and healthy food do exercise regularly use limited social media and don't be lose your confidence read a good book motivational video and you focus on your skill based activity because new education policy 2020 is related with a skill only so i hope that you will focus on your skill best wishes to all my youth and students that thank you great advice sir so now i would like to conclude the interview thank you so much for the all information it is very helpful for the all student and the parents thank you so much for the interview sir thank you